Foreign Intelligence and their tag team partner, Patrick Black. Would you take a look at the wrestler, Patrick Black? I can't believe you're using those two words in the same uh, sentence. Me either, to be honest with you. Patrick Black is going to compete here tonight at Aggression. Well, uh, as close as he can anyway. And, and hopefully uh, he fares better than he did at Doomsday when he was in the ring with senior official Joe Copez. Well, I'll tell you, as top heavy as he, uh, Patrick Hat Black is, with that giant head, opponents. he gets to moving around too fast in that ring, he's going to fall right over. Coming from Cincinnati, Ohio, and Salinas, California, the reigning HWA Tag Team Champions, the Mavericks, and their tag team partner from Flint, Michigan, Joe Copez. The pride of Flint, Michigan, senior official Joe Copez teaming up with the reigning HWA Tag Team Champions, the Mavericks. I thought Michael Moore was the pride of Flint, Michigan. I, I guess it depends who you talk to it. Well, here's somebody who wants to talk to us. Tim Tatum, assistant to the vice president. Wait a minute. Tucker, you've been doing a great job since you started, kid. However, I've got a special referee in mind that's going to keep order right down the middle. This person has a vested interest in this contest, so make your way to the back. And we'll get that special referee out. She is Mary Elizabeth. Oh, what? Excuse me? Mary Elizabeth, the old sweet Moses. Would you take a look at that? That or them? All of it. Right. Every inch of it. My oh my. Good evening. Hello, this referee. I have some officiating over here I need to do as well. Uh, well, let's try to focus on a... I'm focusing right on it. Yeah, I know what you're focusing on, and I, I want to say, let's try to focus on the match and the action. Never has a referee looked better in knee socks. Well, <laughs> well Quint Lee just, just told uh, Mary Elizabeth that... Pigtails? It certainly is. And Quint Sweet Lee, googly moogly. Quint Lee just warned her and said, you know, we got you once, we'll get you again. And he's referring to the WMD that was delivered to this young lady. And, you know, there she go, calling for the bell in this six-man tag team match. Is officially underway in uh, foreign intelligence. I mean, have you ever seen two more sore losers in your life than these guys? I mean. I'm sorry, were you talking to me? Yeah, it, yeah, I was. It, it was well over a month ago that the Mavericks defeated, outsmarted. Foreign Intelligence became the new tag team champions, and, 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 and since then it's been nothing but uh, Foreign Intelligence trying everything they could, everything they can to get the belts back, and you know they're not happy that the titles aren't on the line here tonight, Hooks. Outsmarted, defeated, tag champs, whatever you say. All right, well. Looks like I'll be uh, calling this one on my own, which no, really, I'm, I'm here. I'm right here. Really with isn't Zaro. much that different. Much different than a lot you of the. Get a drink of water here. I'll be fine. Al Hussein now with the side headlock of Oh wait a minute, the solution counters goes right to that hammerlock. Well, I gotta wonder, and by no means am I upset by this because we all know that. Well, we try not to be biased, but neither one of us can stand foreign intelligence here. Nobody can. Will Mary Elizabeth call this thing right down the middle? I mean, she has every reason in the world to try and take her anger and her aggression, if you will, out on foreign intelligence. That's a good point. But Not that they deserve it, but will foreign intelligence get a fair shake here? Well, uh, time will tell, I guess, is the, is the only way to respond to that. Is no doubt Mary Elizabeth has been dying to be a part of this, and, and she, maybe she want to Take that into consideration as well, because she could have a future here as a referee, but. Oh, I see a definite future. I see a lot of things. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Somehow, I don't, I don't believe her future has anything to do with you, though, so. Maybe you should just 
Put I'm, those thoughts out of your mind. And unfortunately, I don't think I can argue with you, but stranger it's things have happened. Man, it's good for a man to have goals. Yeah, well, yeah. Stranger things have happened, but I don't think get that strange. Aaron Williams now tagged in. Goes to work on Ala. Ala Hussein going to the eyes and immediately scurries over to make the tag, but Quint Lee comes in and is greeted with that drop toe hold. Ah, uh, from what I understand, Foreign Intelligence has had Patrick Black in the gym training every day this week. Well, I, 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 I'm not sure a, a week's worth of training is going to be enough. In fact, I know it's not going to be enough to compete against the tag team champions, the Mavericks, but. I, I hear that. I hear Joe Copez is a mad mad in the, in, in the gym as well. Let's see if Patrick's extra work be enough to handle Copez if if the time comes that these two are in the ring with one another. Patrick Black can get in the ring or get in the gym and work out as much as he wants, but. To clean up an old phrase my grandpa used to use, you can't polish feces. I held back there a little bit. Your, your, your grandfather was quite wise. Oh, there's a lot more where that came from. Fortunately, genetics didn't help you there in the wisdom department. Look at this, the double leapfrog and the drop kick. Count of two. Quint Lee now going to work on the solution. Solution driven face first into the buckle and he is in the wrong part of town. And now Allah Hussein tag back in. Allah now going for that suplex. No, the solution went up and over landed on his feet. Oh. Only a counter one. Side headlock take over there by Allen. Look at this, shoulders down, and I'll tell you what, thus far, and Mary Elizabeth has not been uh, showing any bias. Well, I have to disagree right there. Uh, I think Allah had the solution pinned for a good second and a half where she got down there and counted. And it seems to be counting a little slow, if you ask me. I disagree. I think she's been consistent thus far, but and again, I can only stress enough. I can't blame her. No. I would be the same way had they dropped me on my head like they did to her. Of course, if they dropped you on your head, you'd probably still be a convalescent. A what? Exactly. And oh, look at that! The solution may be convalescing after that. Hung up on that rope. Abdomen first and then the boot. That's it. Hey Joe! Hey Joe, he's hurt, buddy! He's right. hurt, baby! And Patrick Black doing a lot of talking for a guy who's not even in the ring and hasn't been in the ring yet tonight. We saw what happened when he got in the ring with Joe Copez at Doomsday. Uh, I just want to point out that I am thankful that both Joe Copez and Patrick Black did not opt to wear tights. Well, for once we agree. The solution ducks the clothes on cross body, but Quint Lee was waiting for him. Could be the pile driver. No! Aaron Williams in! And here we go. One, two. The Mavericks almost took home the victory. Now, Looks like a little ping pong action. Round and round he goes. Everybody taking a turn, even Joe Copez. And this could do it. One, two. Copez. Hey, come on now. You keep, hey, why don't you get it? Quint Lee fired up now after that exchange. And look at the back of Allen Wasselition after those clubbing blows. And now double suplex. Oh. Allah Hussein goes for the cover. One, two. Barely got two. Allah Hussein now with the closed fist. And Mary 
Elizabeth should have been warning him about it, but you got to remember this is her first uh, time out there as a referee. I think Tim Tatum oh. had some ulterior motives for bringing out here, but that's just me. Right. Tim Tatum is thinking along my line. It could be. I think that's why he's a fine addition to the executive staff here in the HWA. And look at this, Patrick Black getting involved illegally. And now, uh, of course, it's when a man is it's caught in the tree of woe, helpless, and the uh, official isn't watching. Now, and now all he was saying, going for the cover, as the solution folded it up, but still not enough to get the win for foreign intelligence and to save uh, his advisor from having to do anything in this one. And a nice double team by foreign intelligence, like him or hate him. These guys work together as a team better than almost anyone in this company. That is why they are one of the most dominant tag teams in the history of the Heartland Wrestling Association. He wants to get it so bad that he can. I'm going to kill you. History will be made here later tonight. Oh, look at this. Fisherman suplex with the bridge. And young Aaron Williams in to make the save. History will be made later tonight as Cody Hawk will compete in his last match here in the HWA against the heavyweight champion, John Moxley. And now gut wrench. Uh-oh. Looked like he was going to go for a suplex, but. And Patrick Black just... saying that's power, and he's absolutely right. Al Hussein almost freakish in his strength. Uh, deceivingly so, one of the strongest men in this company, and he just proved it right there. Yeah, he looked like he was going for, for your uh, standard gut wrench suplex. Just held on to the solution, hoisted him up, and then dropped him in that power bomb. Now there's chin lock applied, and Al Hussein rocking back and forth, putting that weight. On, there you go. Now he's just got all his body weight on top of the solution. And Wasilisha could be fading here and fading fast. He really needs to make a tag to Aaron Williams or, good Lord, even Joe Kopez. Who thought I'd be saying that? And the solution, the instincts have kicked in. He, trying to point his body in the right direction, but he is still stuck in the middle of the ring with that wacky Iraqi. And that's a vice-like grip. Alan Wasilisha with some elbows in the bread basket, hits the ropes. Ducks the clothesline, ducks another. Look at this backslide, perhaps. Can he get, can he get him? Here we go, one, two, three, go. And oh my. Uh, the solution nearly had his uh, head removed from the rest of his body, but still not enough to bring home the victory for the team of foreign intelligence and Patrick Black. And lead back in. Tag team continuity, something foreign intelligence is known for. And there's something Quint Lee is known for, that million dollar fist drop, going for the cover one. Two, three, almost three that time. And oh, uh, are you? Well, of course, Alan yeah. Wasilisha's half dead. Yeah. And Patrick is choking out Alan with those noodle arms. Yeah, Patrick Black's half a man, so I guess this is uh, about as even a contest. And well, well, Patrick Black in and out to do his damage. And again, oh, oh this time a gut buster. And oh. That's the same abdominal region that was slingshotted against the top rope. Come on, brother, come on. Pressure. Come on, baby. Take me in, baby. And again, oh, here he comes, Mr. Confidence, Patrick Black. Patrick like a vulture flying around picking up scraps. There's in a vulture with a head that enormous. Oh! And at this point, it, it just really seems like a matter of time if Born Intelligence could keep up this strategy, keep Allen from making that tag. It, it's only a matter of time before they pick up the win here. And oh, look at that! Well, the tag solution. Aaron Williams. Solution found a hole. He went for it. Made the tag, young Aaron Williams in there. And Patrick Blatt not taking any part in this. 
whatsoever. Aaron Williams, oh! Quentin Lee just comes in and cuts him right off. And I'm not sure, is Quentin Lee still the legal man for foreign intelligence or is it? Uh, I've lost track and unfortunately we've got an inexperienced referee in there who also maybe seems to have lost track. And now Aaron Williams, Tornado DDT, he got it. And now, Patrick Black. Look at this, the, the solution one. with the frog splash. And here we go, is referee Joe Kopes, is he gonna do it? Oh! Kopes levels him with a clothesline! And oh, look at Kopes go! Here we go! Just throwing those fists of fury right into the giant dome of Patrick Black! Kopes is on fire! Going for the choke out. He's got the sleeper hold applied. And meanwhile, the Mavericks and foreign intelligence on the outside. But the lights are beginning to dim for Patrick Black. Well, the lights were dim a long time ago, but he's almost unconscious. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Well, the arm went down once, twice. Wait a minute, jo jo what, what the hell is she doing? What is she, why? What did we just see here? Here are your winners, Foreign Intelligence and Patrick Black. Well, Foreign Intelligence and Patrick Black steal one because, and I, I, I gotta believe that is not what Tim Tatum had in mind. Well, I hope not. If not, we've got a, a crooked person in charge. Just like we had a crooked person in charge of this match, what the hell could she be thinking? This yeah. makes no sense. These are the same guys who, who decimated her with the WMD. And, and now she's in cahoots with these guys? Give me a break. I hate to watch her go, but I love to see her leave. No, I take that back. I want her out of here. Referee Joe Copez down and out. Well, Copez had Patrick Black beat. He certainly did. And he's did. down to the count. Unbelievable turn of events here at Aggression, and we'll have more. I'm pretty sure it's his fault. Son of a biscuit.